Hi guys, how y'all doing? I'm doing okay. I'm having a beautiful day here right out of San Antonio. It's in the 70s today. It's sunshine and beautiful. I'm going to do a really quick reading because it was so pretty today that my dog has jumped the fence and run off. A 130 pound dog is on the loose in the neighborhood and I can only imagine um, how that's going. <laughs> Oh, this dog is driving me crazy, y'all. I mean, he really is. He's driving me crazy. He's an Anatolian Shepherd. You ever seen one of those? He's a cross Anatolian and German Shepherd. But he looks exactly like the Anatolian. He's tan with the floppy ears. But he's humongous. He's 130 pounds at least, if not more. Today, what is today? The um, Wow. Today's the 17th of November. I'm having to look on it. My mind is going, ah from the dog. I can hear my dog out, uh, my husband outside whistling for the dog. I just pray that he'll come back safely. That's all. Just come back safely. All right, so I'm going to do a little reading on Michael Avenatti. Has he been naughty? I don't know. I just want to say that I did do um a little a little yes no with uh, my pendulum and asked if he had, you know, actually assaulted that lady, and it said no. So that's what my, that's what I got the answer from Spirit on this, and I'm just going to do a little reading on what's going on with him right now, okay? It might not give you the answer, but that's the answer. But uh, here's the flavor of the reading. This is the bottom of the deck, and this is the moon. So new information is coming to light. Let's see, the first card I got for him is the Queen of Cups. So this is a woman that is, that's got his back, that's supporting him. She is, um, she's good, she's defending him. She's leading others, other women to, to his defense also. Is his attorney a woman? I wonder. I think I, on the news I saw him walking with a woman, but I don't know if it was his attorney or not. But this is a woman that's defending him and helping him. Okay. It might be his attorney. And then crossing over that card is <clears throat> Seven of Swords. So, you know, the sneaky guy here. So there's some sneaky underhanded things going on for sure. And it's, it's all going to be revealed pretty soon here. In the end, anyway. Everything will be revealed. But there's some sneaky stuff going on, y'all. Really sneaky. And then above his situation, we get the Four of Pentacles. So I think he's having some kind of money worries. You know, this is, he's holding on to his money. So he's going through some kind of money worries. I don't know. I don't know what that's about. But I think that's a reflection of what's he's, what he's going through. And then uh, the foundation of the situation. This is the Emperor. This is about authority and control. So. He does have the situation under control, you know. I think that he's going to be successful um, with the court's, you know, authority. I think he'll be successful with that in the end. Be successful. We'll see. That's, you know, that's what I got with the uh, rose quartz. My yes, no pendulum. And this is the past. So this, he got judgment card in the past, which is weird. Because I know there was a judgment made against him. I think uh, something about him being evicted, his, uh, his law firm was evicted or something from uh, their office space. I, I, I think I saw that somewhere and that he, he was behind on like four months of payments. So that's like $200,000 I think that he's behind on. So there, maybe he is having some money problems. But there was a judgment made against him, and they evicted him. They have to leave. And that was last month, I think. So, yeah, that was in the past. So, yeah, you know, I don't know. He's having a string of bad luck or something. I don't know what that's about. And here's the future card for him. This this is Ten of Wands. So, uh, you know, a person like him that has achieved so much success and, you know, He's just, he has so many pokers in the fire. So he's got a lot of burdens on him. He's got a lot of responsibilities. You know, he's just, he's living the good life. And he's just, 
He's got a lot of things going on at once. And if he doesn't watch out, he could easily lose control. So he really needs to get some first-rate help. Let's, you know, delegate some of these uh, responsibilities to other people so he can focus on what, you know, the priorities are. Okay. I don't like ending on that card. That's the end. I'm going to take one more card just for clarification. Let me get it from the deck here. So... This doesn't clarify anything. This is the hanged man. This is postponing action, stalling. Hey, maybe he needs to do that just in order to, uh, you know, investigate this accuser lady. I mean, I don't know how well he knows her or if he knows what she's up to, but maybe he does have to postpone and stall to, to do all the investigations. Maybe that, maybe that's what's going on. So, all right, that's my reading for the Michael Avenatti. I always did really like him. I'm sorry to see that he's, you know, embattled in all this crap going on. But I guess when you stick your head out, some some people want to hit it, you on the head, you know. So, and there are times you, we hear it a lot of times with, you know, um, men that play sports and stuff. They get sued from women, and uh, sometimes, you know, we we can wonder, was that a a real you know, was that real or was it that people just wanted money or not? So we hear it all the time, you know. It's not nothing new, but uh, I'm sorry to hear that happening to him, especially a guy that we really like and that he's really standing up for women. So hopefully the truth will all come out on this, y'all. Send him some prayers and good love, some love, and, you know, just pray for him and his families. So... I know he's got a big ego, and uh, maybe he's not easy to live with, but he seems like a good guy to, you know, have on your side, put it that way. All right, I have to go. I have to go look for my dog. <laughs> God help me. Everybody send me some good juju. Y'all pray, make sure, you know, pray and uh, ask that I'll find my dog really quickly, because... <laughs> I don't want him to scare somebody, and I don't want him to get hurt, because he's such a precious dog. He's so, so sweet. He's, he wouldn't be mean and bite anybody, but they're, they'd be scared of him. Anyway, I got to go. Uh, if you guys would like a reading, look down below and see my email address and uh, contact me. I do the 10-card Celtic Cross Tarot reading for $25, and it lasts anywhere, I don't know, but 13 minutes up to 18 minutes depending on how much stuff I get out of it so we'll see okay and what else <laughs> that's all I can think of right now my mind's going blank all right guys thank you so much and uh, remember to subscribe to my channel I just saw orb go by I've been seeing lots of orbs in my room it's so weird y'all they're out in the living room now they were just back here and I was thinking is there some trick of the light back here but now my daughter said she saw Orb in the room, in the front room, in the living room. She was sitting there watching TV, and she goes, I just saw an Orb go by. I walked in there, and my husband was like, oh, what's an Orb? You know, he was like that. And um, it was either yesterday, yesterday it was his, his brother that has passed away. It was his birthday. And I have a picture on the shelf. One of my dad, one of his dad, and one of his brother. These three people have all passed away. And my husband saw an orb right around his picture, and it flew out straight, and then it went out the window. <laughs> and he was like, I saw an orb. I'm like, really? And he's like, yes, I saw an orb. It was right by my brother's picture. So that was so cool, you know? It was really cool. So he is a believer, but, you know, there's some things that are new to him, and it's so funny because anytime he has any doubt, he gets confirmation like that. He's very, I don't know, he's very psychic and very spiritual. And he just, he always gets fast confirmation. So lucky him. Anyway, I just want to tell that to y'all. I don't know if you saw that orb. I saw it. <laughs> I don't know. All right. I got to go. I got to go look for my dog. We'll talk to y'all later. Thanks for watching my videos. Uh, hit the like button if you like it. Subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. Thank you for all the messages. Thank you for watching. I love you guys. Do something kind for somebody today. Love you guys so much. Bye.